nice show. No, you're a different sort of small way. In this Shannon is a small village in County Cork, and every June bank holiday it has a steam rally. And it's really outstanding. See later, so you just you just going up to steam, are you? Yeah, that's all, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, she'll leave it in. And how long will that take? Give it about 40 minutes. Yeah. In this one, because she's small, you know? Yeah. Very lively on the road. Very lively on the road, yeah, yeah. okay. Small okay. bit. What's the top speed? Oh, it depends how hard you drive it. <laughs> <laughs> um, comfortably 10 mile an hour in this, Ooh. which is quick for a roller. Did you get through a lot of oil? Uh, yeah. Like this year we went to have a look around and this is some of what we saw. Well done to the organisers and all the exhibitors. What a treat! Apart from steam engines of all shapes and sizes, they had this magnificent sawmill set up. Everybody was working hard, especially the engine. I did worry that I was just about to film some appalling accident. I'm just glad he didn't get his controls muddled up. The quality of the exhibits was really high and there was plenty of good advice too, like this. Of course, I'm sure you're doing this already, aren't you? Sandra found her favourite car. Not sure it would tow a horse box though. That's the car that I learned to drive in. Not that particular one. Well, not that particular car, a little older than that one. A little fact. older. The same sort. Hungry! <laughs> Me too. Did you find something lovely? <laughs> yes, sausages over there. Come on then. And Maybe you could spare one small bit for one the poor, more. poor dog. Well, he might not like it. In. So that's a water pump. Yeah. But he could be driving something else. Oh, right. Oh. The stationary engines made a lovely, friendly, polyrhythmic song as they chugged and spluttered in harmony. This one was my favourite though.
And here's a big old cob horse with a great contraption, the horse gin, short for engine, of course. It took a little while to build up the speed. It will be interesting to know the gearing they used. And this one was hooked up to a winnowing machine and it worked well, though anyone standing nearby got oat seeds thrown at them with great force. What more could you want? Thank you.